Welcome to Twisted Brush Pro Studio. In this tutorial you will learn how to work with masks. Masks allow you to protect parts of your image from being altered. In Twisted Brush, most operations with masks are done from the mask menu. Through the mask tools located on the toolbar. With the mask brushes. And in the special mask edit layer. The quick command panel also has some buttons for quickly managing your masks. There are two ways to create a mask in Twisted Brush. The first one is by using the mask tools on the toolbar. These are the rectangle mask tool, the ellipse mask tool, the polygon mask tool, the lasso mask tool, and the magic wand mask tool. Through these tools, you can create masks with different shapes or masks based on the image luminance, alpha, hue, color ranges, etc. One of the most important mask attributes is the mask level. It determines the level of which a masked image can be altered. The higher the level, the better the image is protected. A 100% mask is a full mask, and it won't permit any changes in the masked area. When using the mask tools, the mask levels can be managed easily through the level slider. This is a 100% mask. And this is a 50% mask. The second way to create masks and twisted brushes by using the mask brushes. If you need to edit a mask, you can use the tools. The mask brushes. And also filters. You can add mask filters from the mask menu, mask filter. A mask feather is also available from the mask menu. The mask feather will soften the edges of your mask. The enable mask option will protect the mask part of the drawing, while display mask controls if the mask is visible. There may be cases when you will need to hide the mask, but still have it active. The clear mask option will remove all masks. Twisted Brush has some other interesting mask options such as to create a mask from image luminance or to create an image from a mask. These options can be valuable if you need to save a mask for subsequent use. You could convert one of the masks to an image and later to turn it back to a mask. The best way to edit a mask is through the special mask edit layer. Here you can use not only the mask tools and brushes, but all tools and brushes available in Twisted Brush. Just remember that if you use brushes to edit a mask in this special layer, the mask level will depend on the luminance levels. For stronger masks use darker colors. Additional mask settings can be found in the Preferences dialog in the Edit menu. If you want, you can make the masks to be fully opaque instead of transparent. Or to change the mask display colors, 